Are you a dreamer? Do you have a dream? Something that you wanted for yourself or for others? How far are you willing to go for it? Hi, I am Lolek Angeles, a fourth year industrial engineering student, and my dream is to be a distinguished entrepreneur and content creator. There's a simple way to know if what you're doing is your passion. Your passion is something that you love to do so much that you can't wait for tomorrow to do it all over again. I've been balancing my life as an entrepreneur and student for almost two years now. It's crazy how long it has been and how long I've been working on my dream. I admit it has been the toughest yet best years of my life so far. In your journey, you'll eventually see how harsh the real world is, how unfair life is, and you'll fail more than you can count. However, I always tell myself that every failure just makes you wiser. It just makes you braver. Eventually, your dream will become something more than just a goal. Your dream becomes a part of who you are, and that's what makes it worth fighting for. I wake up as early as 7 a.m. every morning to catch up on the work I need to do for my business and the classes I need to take. I usually start with doing all my emails from personal to my businesses. When there are no classes, I do some business errands such as accounting, planning, and packing orders. My quote-unquote short attention span may be a hindrance, so I have to stop with any errands to focus on my online classes. Our classes usually take at least half of the day with a few breaks in between. I try to do as much work as possible during those vacant periods. Basically, my day goes like that. Grind, school, grind, school, then grind again, rest for a bit, then school, then grind again, until I go to sleep, and do the same thing all over again the next day. Okay, I'll confess. There are times, especially last Christmas season, I was extremely busy packing shop orders and arranging career pickups during classes for a whole week. Sorry to my professors. You might ask, don't you have a lie? Don't you do things for fun? Or don't you hang out with your friends? Well, I do. But first of all, my work is fun. Sure, it is very tiring. But there's nothing I'd rather do than this. I got off my comfort zone, experienced events, conventions, met some amazing people, and created outstanding products I never thought I could. It does get stressful sometimes, but I got my friends and family with me, my support system. My friends and I hang out more often now than we used to. The pandemic made me realize how people and time can be easily taken away from you. I don't want to regret it ever. I try to make time in my busy schedule to go out with my friends. It really helps that face-to-face -face classes in UST are back. Walking around UST and going outside frequently unexpectedly helped my mental health. It was nice seeing the well-architectured buildings, the Tomashian community, and friends often again. And also having the opportunity to create more college memories that were once lost due to the pandemic. Now. It's my, our last semester, hopefully. Our time together in UST is a little more emotional and meaningful. Whenever I see my friends' faces, I wonder what the future holds for us. I always hope that all of us will eventually achieve our own dreams and be proud of each other, no matter what happens. Even after graduation, there's still more failures and challenges that will get in our way. But I really hope we stay in each other's lives, forgive each other, be there for each other, be there for the ups and the downs, and I hope that we never forget each other. Even with your own journey for your dream, it doesn't matter where you go, it's who's with you on the journey that makes it matter, more meaningful. Just remember, no matter what. We're here for each other. 
never stop believing in yourself and never stop dreaming. I am John Carl Lolek Angeles, Tomasian engineer, and I am and always will be a dreamer. Thank you.